फिर उसको मैं कह लूँ स्ट्रक्चर्स यू नो वी हैव लर्न्ड द प्रिपरेशंस और कमर्शियल मेथड लैब मेथड ऑफ केमिनोफोर वी आल्सो डन द केमिकल प्रॉपर्टीज इट इज ऑक्सीडाइजिंग प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ केमिनोफोर डन लेट अस कम बैक एंड एंड द टॉपिक विद स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ केम मैंगनेट एंड पर मैंगनेट वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट इन योर डीएनए ब्लॉक इन योर पी ब्लॉक स्ट्रक्चर्स आर वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट प्लीज डू प्रैक्टिस इट सो व्हेनेवर आई से मैंगनेट आयन एंड पर मैंगनेट आयन सिंपल इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग मैंगनेट इज एमएनओ4 2 charge because we have got it from potassium uh, manganese isn't it k2mno4 where we have broken into 2k plus and mno4 minus 2 so mno4 per manganese is mno4 minus remember this this is minus 2 and this is minus per manganese now when i have to draw the structure simple both are similar only light difference mn here again manganese in the center then you have four oxygen atoms observe first oxygen atom uh, suppose okay let us start from here let us start from here first one oxygen atom double bond one more oxygen atom double bond you have left two oxygen atom it is isn't it now one oxygen atom here one oxygen atom here minus and minus two two four done so minus two is a charge now when i have to come back to permanganate ion the same thing the four there is only one oxygen atom with minus observe carefully so one oxygen double bond one more oxygen double bond one more oxygen double bond and the fourth oxygen atom is one just observe oxygen minus one what are you observing both are they have a shape of tetrahedral isn't it isn't it tetrahedral arrangement so they are tetrahedral the shape is tetrahedral here also the shape is tetrahedral yes now let us come back and see we have already uh, studied the color of uh, manganese ion is green isn't it this is a green colored ion green the color of permanganate is purple simple next important when i see the structure okay this is going to show resonance isn't it so when i see the structure of this how many unpaired electrons does it have it has one unpaired electron you yes saw no because this is going to shift here this is going to shift here so there's only one unpaired electron so okay it has one unpaired electron now when you observe here how many do you have any unpaired electron no isn't it because this is going to shift here this is going to shift here so important no unpaired electron come back in this particular thing when you have one unpaired electron what is the magnetic property of this magnetic property when this unpaired electron we call them as paramagnetic in nature when i have to see this magnetic property it is diamagnetic in nature because it doesn't have diamagnetic in nature simple isn't it a thing just remember please try to draw and learn this ion try to draw the structure both and try to write the parameters which are important 1 2 3 parameter 1 2 3 parameter more than enough for your structure 